You know, there was this one Sahabi, one man. He was just in the mosque with the Prophet. And he walked, walked out and he ran back crying. And he came to the Prophet and he said, Ya Rasulullah, inni uhibbuk. O Messenger of Allah, don't leave here until you know I love you. And the Prophet ﷺ said, Uhkum ma taqul. Think, deliberate about what you just said. And the man said, Wallahi inni la uhibbuk. By God, I love you, Ya Rasulullah. Sallallahu alayhi wa And the Prophet ﷺ said, If you love me, then be prepared for test and trial. Life isn't going to be easy for you. There's things you have to sacrifice and give up on account of me. You have to fast and endure and push hard. And trials and tests will come upon you quicker than the water flows down the side of a mountain after heavy rain. Like a landslide, like a tsunami of tests. Think again of what you said. He said, Ya Rasulullah, inni uhibbuk. I'm willing to face it on account of that love. But Ya Rasulullah, I fear that even though I love you and I'm, I try to be a good man, when I die, I don't know if I will go to Jannah. I don't know if I'll make it to paradise. But you will be with the prophets. And you will be the martyrs, and you will be with the highest of people. I'm never going to see you again. It made me cry that I'll never see you again. And the Prophet ﷺ, Jibreel descended. And revelation came from Allah. And the Sahaba, they said, there was no ayah in the Qur'an that was revealed that made us more happy than this verse. That Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, those who have obedience to Allah and His Messenger, and they love Allah and His Messenger, for them, I will join them with the Prophets, the acceptors of truth, I will allow them to be with the Prophet of Allah, even though they haven't done and deserved that rank, on account of love. Begin with that love in your home with your husband, with your wife, with your children, with your mother, with your father.